Hey there lovers, it's DJ Pamela MC. Welcome back to my channel. Kisses and hugs. Welcome, welcome back. So this is still day four of me in hospital, day four of my recovery. And I am going to do a hospital food review mukbang um, for the hospital's lunch food. So this is lunch today. So we've got lots, looks like lots here. <laughs> so we have obviously water, as you know, lots of water is a must. We have soup, which is cream of vegetable soup. So the fact that I'm getting cold is kind of a good sign um, because I pretty much, the sweats, sweating has almost stopped, which is great. Knives and forks, Ugh, if I can open it. Um, I must admit after a while you get over hospital food, especially when you stay a while because it's <laughs> Pretty much the same kind of food, but it's food, so I'm very thankful. All right, so we have sandwiches, what kind? Silver side and pickle sandwiches. Put that there for now. Apple juice, which obviously I've already got heaps in my drawer. I will give that to the main kitchen. Someone else can have that. Four, we've got some fruit here. Yeah, oh, what kind of fruit? Two fruits, little fruit cups. I obviously have heaps of those too. I will put that in the main fridge for someone else. We have vanilla bulla ice cream. I don't really eat a lot of ice cream, but that will be yummy. We'll have a little bit. I don't buy ice cream at home, really. Not very often. For lunch, what have we got? Lamb kaftas in a tomato-based sauce with rice and vegetables. So let's open this. So what are you going to have for lunch today? Or dinner or breakfast, whatever time it is for you, whatever part of the world you're in. Let's open the soup. I love soups. It's very hot. I have to be careful. Oh. All right, and yummy, I love, I have to say, their side salads are really beautiful because I love salads, I, I do, I love salads, all kinds of salads. We're definitely gonna have some of that. We we'll just have some orange. You can have some. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Ah. So to be honest, um, we're allowed to order Uber Eats. So possibly tonight or tomorrow, I am going to order food delivery. Um, obviously the past few nights, no way, because I had no appetite. I waste, you know what I mean? Not waste, but I couldn't eat much at all. I just couldn't. Pepper, pepper. Um, oh, and we also have um, this Italian salad dressing, which is so, so yummy. I would normally, at, if I was at home, I'd put lemon. That's just me. But this dressing tastes really good. Remember always, extra salt and pepper. You get it from the main kitchen and stock up, keep it in your room in your little side drawer. Trust me, you need it for the flavor. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> All right, what did I do, Pepper? I'll do one more. Okay. Okay. So I'm actually using, um, this is the hospital bed. Um, my door to go out is here. The bathroom over there, side table there, and a beautiful big window here. Um, I actually have the best view in this ward, this part of the hospital. 
All right, let's dig in. Soup. All right. So as you can see, the food, it, it's quite similar. Or, you know, like the same things, kind of. All right, I have to be so careful. Ooh, can you have some? It doesn't look really nice, but it does taste okay. Let's have a look. I have to be careful because I'm shaky and I don't want to burn myself, of course. Mm. It's very hot. Mm. That is nice. But then again, I'm a soup lover. I love all kinds of soups. I do. I'm going to do cook with me, a lot of cook with me videos. So stay tuned for that because that will be something fun. I've done one. So if you look way back in my videos, I have done one cook with me and I cooked a roast. Oh, oh, mm. that is hot. Beautiful. It's nice and hot. So I've had, I had this one before, I had this a few nights ago, only a little bit because I couldn't, I wasn't hungry. But the sauce is really nice. All right. I'll try to use my knife, but at the moment it's really hard for me, um, as you will see. Um, I get embarrassed, so please, yeah, don't make fun of me or anything because I'm still recovering and yeah. And I just, you know, I wanna share this because this is my journey in life, what I'm going through at the moment, which is a really difficult time. And just to help others that might be going through, you know, a really hard time um, dealing with addictions, um, anxiety, depression, you know, any kind of mental illness and things like that, so. Yeah, if I can, you know, just help give even just one person some positive hope in life, then I know I've done a good thing, you know? Okay. Uh. Mm. It has a lot of flavor, but... It does need a lot of salt and pepper. Like it's flavor, but bland, but that's hospital food. That's how it's meant to be. You know what I mean? They're not gonna put chili in your food, are they? <laughs> While you're in hospital. No. <sighs> okay. All right. It's easier if I use my fork, to be honest, um, because of the you know, shakes. Mm -mm. So I haven't been sleeping well. And this morning I was up since like 4 a.m. Um... So I did um, a few things online that I had to do business-wise. So I took care of that. Um, and to be honest, me filming while I'm in here, now that I'm, you know, getting better and I can function properly more, I want to come online. I want to talk to you all. I want to say, hi, hey, how are you? You know, um, yeah. Because obviously with what's happening all over the world, for us, we're not allowed to sit in the main kitchen area where normally we would all eat together. Who's ever in here, you know, in recovery. 
um, we'd all sit in the main kitchen together and eat and, you know, interact. But with what's happening, we're not allowed because of safety reasons, of course, um, due to the pandemic. So, mm. have some. It's really yummy. Yummy. Really, really nice. The thing is with hospital food, <laughs> okay, you have to eat it as soon as it arrives. <laughs> They're really nice. They actually bring it to my room for all of us. They bring it to our rooms um, because, yeah, we're not allowed to really interact. We do a little bit, you know. But then the nurses will come and say, okay, come on, everyone, back to your room. <sighs> so, yeah. Okay. Mm. Uh, it's so nice and warms up your belly. It's nice and warm in the tummy. Mmm. I miss my soup spoons. I know, I sound like a snob. <laughs> but if I'm having soup, I love a soup spoon. Mm. This is this one's really nice. Really nice. Mm. It's hot. All right. Here we go. <laughs> See, now it's starting to go cold, but it's still edible. So it's got carrots, beans, peas, rice. <gasps> oh, no. It's okay. I miss my baby girl cat Munchker and I cannot wait to get home to see her um, but obviously I'm not ready to mentally I'm not ready yet to leave here so and part of my uh, detox is I need to be here for seven days um, so tomorrow it's the weekend the doctors don't see us over the weekend, um, but they'll be in tomorrow and she will, the doctor will see me again. Well, it's two doctors, a male and a female. Um, yeah, there's lots more to talk about with that, <laughs> though that will be another, at another time. Hmm. I will do one more. I like to kind of mix a bit of the sauce, a bit of the rice, and the meat and the ball, the meatball. Alrighty, hold on. Mm-hmm. Okay, that's enough of that. You can see that I actually quite ate quite a bit. But I'm, yeah, enough of that. I didn't tell them I was filming lunch. <laughs> this, you've got to put it on, ready? Oh, oh, yes. Normally I would use two of these. They always put extra in the fridge for us with the sandwiches and everything. So that if we get a bit hungry later, we can help ourselves. I'm gonna try, ready? Let's do one of the sandwiches. Come on. Mmm. It's nice to be getting my appetite back, to be honest. All right. Okay. Oh, so please have some. It's nice and fresh. Always miss made made fresh every day. 
They have to. Mm. <clears throat> um, it's a little bit, it's hard to swallow, a bit dry. Um, but that's, <clears throat> excuse me. That's just me and my body because, like I said in my last video, um, I wasn't really eating before I came into hospital. So, yeah. My body's getting used to having food again. A bit more soup. Mmm. One more. Okay, no more soup. Ugh. We'll do one more sandwich. I like the sandwiches. Yesterday was egg and lettuce sandwiches. They were yummy. They were yummy. Mmm. -hmm. What is it? I'll eat that maybe later. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm. Excuse me. So it was actually nice. Like I woke up, I did things and I was tired, blah, blah, blah. So I had a little nap. I slept for like one hour. So I just woke up not long ago and then lunch arrived with this beautiful big capsicum. Mm. Oh, have some. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Yum. I love good, healthy food. Mmm. So fresh. Crunchy. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm so naughty. I know I shouldn't use my hands. All right, come on. <laughs> Have to act like a lady. Cucumber. Mmm. Hear that crunch. Tastes divine. Mm. Mm. All right. Let's do one tomato. All right, hold on. <laughs> Let's hope I can do this because I know the plastic knife, it won't cut it. Might be able to cut through it. Mm. Mm. Fresh, juicy, so 
so good for you. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. Excuse my fingers. that's enough for me <laughs> so you can see I'm eating more each time each day um, yeah still not a huge appetite but getting there you know what let's try a little bit of this ice cream because I don't normally eat ice cream mm. it's vanilla and Bula Ice Cream is a beautiful brand. brand. <gasps> really? <laughs> oh. mm. Mm, that's good. That is good. <laughs> mm. It is melted. Look, it's so creamy. So, so creamy. Mmm. Mmm. I should want to eat the whole thing. Mmm. <laughs> Yum. I haven't eaten ice cream. Oh my goodness. I don't know how long. Mmm. And guess what? Mmm. I just ate the whole thing. <laughs> They're cute little tubs. All right. Now I'm really full. So lovers, that is my lunch for today. It is good. Um, this, I didn't, it's okay, but I don't really like it that much. The soup is okay. I can't have it all. I don't feel like it all because... I start to feel sick. <clears throat> so, so this is lunch, hospital food, today on day four of my recovery. So I hope you're eating something yummy and I hope you have a beautiful day. Um, make sure you do something nice for yourself. Always remember to be kind to others. Um, you know, because you never know what another person might be going through. You really don't. Um, yeah, so I'm always someone that's always mishappy, always missed together. You know what I mean? On top of the world and doing things to make everyone else happy. Yet I forgot about myself, you know. So um, it's very important to remember yourself and your soul and what's important to you and to do things that make you happy. It's very important. All right. I love you all. Time to go. And I shall be back with more. Kisses. Love you all. Mm -hmm.